this is just one of those days. It looks like nothing really wants to eat. I don't want to give up yet though. I think I still could get blown up on by something. Oh my gosh, that's a good fish. That feels decent. Welcome back. I'm actually finishing editing this video right now. I filmed it like September 18th, so it was kind of a while ago. That's why I was fishing with a frog. Like right now, I'm still fishing with topwaters, but I'm not frogs, I guess. But showing up at this pond, I was planning on catching some carp. I didn't find any, and while I was looking for them, I saw this giant mat of snot grass. I figured there'd be some bass under it, so I threw my frog out. I was getting blow up after blow up, so I'd say it's a pretty decent video. Y'all definitely should watch to the end, but without further ado, we're gonna go ahead and hop right into it. This is just one of those days. It looks like nothing really wants to eat. I don't want to give up yet though. I think I still could get blown up on by something. Oh my gosh. That's a good fish. Get in here. It's the form fish. It has a huge head, but super skinny i had a feeling i was gonna get bit dude i was just saying i was like this could be one of those days but i still think there's a chance i could catch one that fish is so deformed but i mean i'll take it yeah i estimate right about two two and a half pounds we're gonna go ahead send it back there he goes now that i think of it i probably should throw him walking frog because this stuff up here is going to be a nightmare to try to work this thing this is bad i've never seen so much of it in these ponds near me like this is not good blow up oh no there he is let's go oh my gosh I'm waiting for that crush the frog like a one and a half pounder probably not far from two let me go ahead send him back here real quick there he goes. They're literally just sitting under this stuff. Just waiting for this thing to pass over them and then they just come up and clobber it. We're gonna keep bringing this frog through this stuff. There's plenty more fish in here and I know it. Feeling good about this one. Oh my gosh. Oh, I almost just fell. Just crush that thing. Another nice fish. That's a two pounder. I'm gonna send them back. I don't wanna take too much time with these fish. I want them to be healthy. It's definitely fun while it lasted. That feels decent. Lots of dragging him through all this stuff. Landing. Just crushed the frog and I brought a whole pile of slop with them too. So we got like our third or fourth fish, I don't know. But another pound and a half or pretty good fish. Yeah, we're gonna go ahead and send it back. Alright. There she goes. What a beauty though. So that's gonna bring this video to a close. I'll go ahead and show you all the frog I was using real quick. It is a 
poppin' pad crasher right there. And I'm just gonna tell you, I wouldn't recommend throwing a poppin' frog in heavy cover like I was fishing. I'd go for a walkin' frog, but in this like situation, I was just, I was kinda in a rush and it was working for me and I was seeing better hookups with this frog over some of my other walkin' frogs. So I figured I'd fish with this and it ended up working. I did miss a few fish though, they weren't on camera. I think it was maybe one or two fish, so nothing crazy. But I hope y'all enjoy. If you did, go ahead, leave a like, subscribe, and hopefully I'll see y'all in the next one.